Hello everyone, let's keep practicing. I have here this very cute bow. So as we go on, please follow me and you'll get the hang of shading and drawing. So let's do it. Wait, I'll change my pencil. I picked up the wrong one. Okay, so let's use this graphite pencil. So when I do the bow, I start in the middle again, focal point. So you can estimate the symmetry of the left and the right um, ribbon or the lobe. So let's do it. So when I see a picture again, what's the shape in it? I see a square here. Let's do the square. Here. Is it the right size of square that we like? Yes. Basically, you will make it a little lighter, but I'm shading it now to make it a little dark. Because it's still small. It's just a small drawing. Just for practice purposes. And then here, we are going to make a slant. And then go down. And connect. It's like a ball, right? Slant, curve, and then connect here. Okay? And then we are going to do the same on the other side. Just as near as the size of the one we just did. So, slant, curve, and connect. You can always adjust. Okay? So there. That's your first part. And then after that, we are going to put another lobe, another slant on the lobe, and then slant on the lobe, okay? So you can make it puffier or bigger, but this is just to make things simple. There. Okay, so are you sure of the size, are you sure of the shape, and then you make it dark. You can always um, go back and see my old videos, because in my old videos, I have referred to some tips that um, I'm talking to, talking about on the other videos. So there's your bow. And then we're going to put the tail. So with the tail, you can um, make it overlapping or just make it do like that. You can make it longer or wavy. We're just going to make it simple here, okay? This is just for um, showing you a very simple approach to draw a simple bow but very cute okay and then we are going to shade now now when we shade I start at the line here going up so I make it long on the side and make it curve and then long on the side again so long, short, long, and then I follow how I lined it, okay? And then here too, so I make it like curve, long on the side, short in the middle, long on the side, right? Don't worry about some spaces because we are going to blend it. And then here again, so it's long on the side, short in the middle, and then long on the side. Okay, and then we're going to do it here too. Easy, right? Long on the side, and then short in the middle. Make it kind of curve, okay? Curve, 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 curve. Okay, it's like co co curve, curve, so it looks puffy. Okay, if there's some extra there, we can fix it later. Okay, so as long as there's dark and light.
again dark and light right and then in the middle I do the same so I just follow how the line is here okay just a little shadowing there and doing the same here so see I follow how the line is under and I put some space there see I put some space I put some space there because I want to show the contrast of light and dark and then here again I start at the corner long and short and then long corner corner and then leave some space there and then here I just do it in the middle leave some space there it's up to you how creative your mind is how you would like it to be and then I go back again here just to make sure that the edges are kind of smooth because I've been um, <clears throat> starting my shading there so there's some extra extra lines that came out see those lines? yeah, you just want to make it smooth just to make it prettier but don't worry too much because we're still gonna blend it okay and then my q-tips we're gonna blend it so here just slowly okay make sure there's still the contrast of the brighter and the darker side there just follow the lines and smoothly smoothly blend it just follow the lines and here there you got your bow you can make this puffier by making more curve like that or bigger but I just want to make it really simple for you to follow see now you got your cute bow well thank you so much for watching and following with me I hope you spread uh, the love of art and please subscribe like and share so we all stay happy and um, sh keep sharing. Thank you. Bye, guys.